principal of the Information Technology School here at Fairchild Wheeler. What makes our high school unique is the way we deliver our curriculum. Here, technology weaves its way through all our classes. We need a system that's robust enough for kids to be able to do this engineering component. It's not just about surfing the web or having access to internet-based services. We also need them to have hard drive-driven applications that they can work through. Our implementation has always been a one-to-one -one Microsoft laptop. Whenever we're evaluating an application for STEAM or STEM purposes, the very first thing that we find is that if we don't have a Windows device, we're not able to do what we need to do. For coding and other types of applications that require a full application suite, you can't simply do that on a Chromebook. We were able to take our Windows 7 devices across the district and we were able to seamlessly upgrade them to Windows 10. We're able to use Intune for Education to be able to easily update the applications and hit all of the devices in record time, which is fantastic for anybody who's managed IT. In prior years, we had to depend on the IT department to come into the building and they went through the process of re-imaging. With our new implementation of Windows 10, I'm able to do this myself with my staff here on campus without the need for the IT department to intervene. That's a big win. Windows 10 is really helpful for collaborating with other teachers, specifically in Teams. We're able to plan interdisciplinary lessons. We're able to do vertical planning with other teachers in our department. We're able to discuss any concerns we have with students, even if that teacher isn't in the same planning period as we are. Our students have access to more technology on a smaller budget now with the implementation of Windows 10. The move to Windows 10 helps to support our vision and ultimate development of a college and career ready child by making sure that the learning curve to get into college is completely removed.